Aries 2020 Horoscope, March 21 to April 19, Your Blueprint for Success Whoever said Aries are better at starting projects than finishing them hasn't met the 2020 version of you. This could be your most successful year in over a decade provided you make the right moves. Your Aries 2020 horoscope is a success blueprint that revolves around setting one or two epic goals and giving that mission all of your blood, sweat, and tears. Resist FOMO and narrow the field, Aries. That's how you'll finish out the year with a fedora full of feathers. Can do Jupiter has officially joined discipline Saturn and transformational Pluto in Capricorn, and this persevering trio supplies the unwavering focus to take it all the way. This year, you'll have bottomless refills of stamina, provided you don't spread yourself too thin. Bottom line, 2020 is a huge year for success. Aries 2020 Horoscope, Career and Money Since Capricorn rules your 10th house of career, you'll be obsessed with figuring out your sole purpose. If you're already marching along your path, scale up your mission or expand into new territories. Long hours at the office won't bother you at all. You might just set up a workspace at home this year so you don't have to sacrifice all your family time to achieve your goal. That said, nailing the elusive work-life balance will be a worthy challenge in 2020. With three final eclipses hitting the Cancer-Capricorn axis between January and July, you could get pushback from loved ones if you skip too many family gatherings or bring your laptop to the kitchen table so you can work through dinner. With all this high-profile energy afoot, renegade rams will have to set aside punk rock ways and learn to play by the corporate rules, at least some of the time. But from March 21 to July 1, Sensei Saturn lunges into rebellious, team-spirited Aquarius, giving you a chance to bend, or rewrite. A few of those laws. Before you go there, push yourself to gain a fundamental understanding of these directives. They do have a purpose, even if you consider it archaic. Saturn will return to Aquarius again from December 17 until March 7, 2023, so don't get overly hung up on changing the game this year. It's more important that you learn how said game is played and what makes the players tick. On December 19, 2020, Daredevil Jupiter will join Saturn in Aquarius until December 29, 2021. Just in time for the holidays, your popularity shoots through the roof. You'll find yourself at the center of a buzzing community of activists, thought leaders, and disruptors. Home sweet home. Your charitable holiday donations may be heftier than usual, as this Aquarian energy stokes your idealistic nature. Aries 2020 Horoscope, Love and Relationships Romance gets a revamp for everyone in 2020, too. Venus turns retrograde from May 13 to June 25, a cycle that happens every 18 months. This time, the love planet backs through Gemini and your friendly, flirty third house. Lines could blur in ways that are both beguiling and a tad troubling, so don't let your rash nature guide your moves. The third house is the realm of co-workers and neighbors, two groups of people you should think twice about fooling around with. What might feel like a convenient spring fling could leave you feeling beyond awkward around your office or apartment complex. On a positive note, Venus Backspin could give you the courage to admit that your feelings go beyond friendship for someone who makes you swoon. Coupled Aries can use Venus Retrograde to strengthen communication. Are you insisting on autonomy at the expense of harmony? See where you can compromise and cooperate more. If love feels like a low priority, or sidelined, agenda item in the first half of 2020, no stress. On June 27, your ruler, Lusty Mars, pops off an extended tour through Aries that lasts all the way until January 6, 2021. Your sex magic will be a strong brew, Aries, and without even trying, you'll have fans clamoring for your attention. Use this magnetism judiciously. The goal is to attract multidimensional people into your orbit the types who won't bore you once the flattery wears off. Besides, Chiron, the wounded healer comet, is spending its first full year in Aries, where it will hover until April 2027. Since April 2018, 
when Chiron briefly popped into your sign, you've been deepening your connection to your shadow nature, learning how to powerfully turn some of your so-called stumbling blocks into your own healing gifts. For this reason, it's even more important to surround yourself with people who won't let you get away with being anything less than your fullest, truest self. Taurus 2020 Horoscope, April 20 to May 20, your reinvention tour begins. Check your rearview mirror, Taurus. Can you see your comfort zone fading to a distant blur? 2020 could bring unprecedented growth and freedom, if you can get more comfortable taking risks. Keep a bag packed, bull. With Uranus twerking through your sign until April 26, 2026, the reinvention tour wages on in Taurus, shaping your 2020 horoscope. And with a trio of planets Jupiter, Saturn and Pluto journeying through Capricorn and your nomadic ninth house in 2020, citizen of the world could become your new handle. Ever since radical Uranus shifted into your sign on May 15, 2018, you've been propelled into uncharted terrain. On many days, the floor beneath your loafers feels more like quicksand than reclaimed wood. Even wilder? In order to ground yourself, you've had to stay in perpetual motion, at times, with no clear idea of your actual destination. For a fixed earth sign, this irregular rhythm can feel mind-boggling, to say the least. You're the pillar amongst your peeps, the dependable rock. But try as you might to uphold traditions, your old way of life is steadily slipping away. The pressure to evolve may feel downright Darwinian at times adapt or become a dinosaur. Fortunately, you are the tenacious Toro, as capable as metamorphosing as the rest of us. But you'd better start adding spontaneity into your steadfast equation in 2020. Then, fasten your seatbelt and get ready for a wild and exhilarating ride. Bottom line, 2020 could bring freedom and adventure. Taurus 2020 Horoscope, Career and Money With your enthusiastic and expansive ninth house number lit, 2020's planets help you face your changing circumstances with a rare sense of enthusiasm, and, dare we say, joie de vivre. That might also mean scrapping your meticulous 10-year plan or cashing in on an investment before it's reached full maturity. Should you find yourself suspended between two worlds, do not panic. With horizon broadening Jupiter in Capricorn and your open-minded ninth house until December 19, you'll be shocked by your own versatility. This is the year to be a student of life, opening your mind to discoveries. Since Jupiter is the galactic gambler, your play at safe nature won't hold you back when it's time to leap. Risky moves you would never have considered in the past might seem sane and logical in 2020. Both Jupiter and Uranus have a teenage quality to them, and in 2020, you could feel as fearless, and frisky, as a 15-year-old. Simultaneously, structure-obsessed Saturn and control freak Pluto will travel alongside Jupiter in Capricorn, providing some semblance of a safety net. These powerhouse planets have been settled in Capricorn's realm for a while Saturn since December 19, 2017. And Pluto since November 27, 2008. Fear not, Taurus, you haven't lost all touch with your common sense. Even if you do have moments where you just want to escape off the grid, status-conscious Saturn and Pluto won't let you give up all worldly possessions to follow a guru across the globe. A three-month stint in an ashram, however, is not out of the question in 2020. It doesn't hurt that career-focused Saturn is heading to the top of your chart, activating your professional true north. From March 21st to July 1st, the ambitious planet darts into Aquarius and your 10th house for a quick warm-up before retreating into Capricorn and taking a final lap. This three-and-a-half-month preview will get you thinking seriously about the direction of your future. And, huzzah, since Saturn is naturally at home in the 10th house, this short spell will re-energize your planning powers, giving you one of the best windows of 2020 for getting a profitable mission off the ground. When Saturn finally drops anchor in Aquarius from December 17, 2020, until March 7, 2023, you'll be ready to embrace the mantle of leadership once again. 
but will you play the role of the executive superstar, Taurus, or would signing your own paychecks be your cup of oolong? Or maybe a mix of both? As entrepreneurial Jupiter rises to Aquarius and joins Saturn in your 10th house this December 19th, you may feel pulled in both directions. Two days later, on the winter solstice, there will be an ultra-rare and exact alignment of Jupiter and Saturn at zero degree Aquarius. This meetup, which only happens every 20 years, is called the Great Conjunction. Given that it's taking place in the most ambitious zone of your solar chart, you could make yet another shocking move near December 21st, kicking off your Havianos and stepping into a pair of power pumps. If you felt adrift with your career earlier in 2020, don't freak out. The Great Conjunction will help you harmonize the polarities of Jupiter's free-spiritedness and Saturn's demands for structure. In the meantime, your exploratory missions are the best possible form of research you can do this year. It's not often that your routine-driven sign is this liberated from the proverbial box. In 2020, trust that all your meandering has the potential to guide you into a fulfilling future. The more purposefully uncomfortable you can make yourself, the stronger and wiser you'll feel when the ball drops on 2021. Your ruler, value-driven Venus, will also keep the coffers full in 2020, along with a new series of eclipses which falls on your financial axis. From April 3rd to August 7th, Venus shakes her moneymaker in Gemini in your second house of daily bread. Due to a retrograde from May 13th to June 25th, Venus spends four times longer than average in this zone of your chart. The boost probably won't be enough to afford you a private island, but it will keep steady cash flowing in, which is music to your security-loving ears. Especially while Jupiter and Uranus make you feel like a space cadet and interdimensional traveler for most of 2020. Think outside the 9-to-5 box, bull. Two eclipses will jangle your 8th house of big money on June 5th and December 14th. It could bring you a fruitful sale of property, a deal that pays you in royalties, or a chance to be a ground floor investor in a savvy startup. Taurus 2020 Horoscope, Love and Relationships Since Venus is the ruler of love, she'll institute a firm no romance without finance policy this year. Single bulls will have little tolerance for a Tinder date who doesn't reach for their wallet when the check comes, as an act of generosity as opposed to archaic gender roles. And if they have no plans for building a stable future, it's an instant buy. Between April and August, coupled Torians could come into cash as a result of your S.O.S. good fortune, through their income, an inheritance, or a mix of both. Serious talks about spending, saving and investing must be had in 2020. Fortunately, Venus is the cosmic diplomat, which makes it easier to discuss the taboo topic of money. And should all the fast-moving energy of 2020 necessitate a major life change, courageous Mars has your back. The warrior planet will hold an extended pose in Aries and your 12th house of healing. Transitions and endings from June 27, 2020, to January 6, 2021. During the retrograde phase, which lasts from September 9 to November 13, you may need a timeout to grieve a transition. What's a fantasy and what's an illusion? You could spend time grappling with this question in the fall. Want to pen a poetic farewell? You'll be a regular roomie in the second half of 2020. Just be careful not to let guilt overtake you. Mars in Aries hastens your departure. When it's time to move on, you simply must, bull, or else you'll stagnate. Instead of thinking of this as the end, how about, until we meet again? Gemini 2020 Horoscope, May 21st to June 20th, Money, Sex, and Power Are you ready to go all the way in? In 2020, you could create deep bonds, from soulmates to financial mergers, but there's a catch. You'll volley between two extreme realities in 2020, Gemini. Thankfully, your dualistic sign enjoys variety though you probably haven't experienced it quite as palpably as your Gemini 2020 horoscope suggests. At moments, your urge to merge will be insatiable. Other times, you'll want oceans between you and anyone demanding a commitment. 
superficial relationships are a no-go in 2020, and it will be impossible to hold loved ones at arm's length this year. On December 2, 2019, expansive Jupiter embarked on an extended night swim through Capricorn and the mysterious, alluring waters of your eighth house of joint ventures, permabonding and sexuality. With intrepid Jupiter exploring this esoteric reef until December 19, 2020, you'll discover hidden dimensions of your own psyche. And what's the good of unearthing a buried treasure if you can't share your findings with everyone in your life? You're ruled by messenger Mercury, Gemini, and you're wired to spread information like a viral campaign. Deep discoveries lead to even deeper conversations in 2020. Alchemical Pluto accompanies Jupiter in Capricorn all year, along with authoritative Saturn for most of 2020. With all that mastery and magnetism at your behest, you could move the masses as an influencer. Just be careful not to turn your cult of personality into a literal cult, Gemini. Bottom line, 2020 could be a huge year for sex, intimacy, and bonding. Gemini 2020 Horoscope, Career and Money Although your popularity will soar, hosting this cosmic trio in Capricorn and your intimate eighth house can bring out your rare introverted streak. Set up a sacred oasis at home your own Virginia Wolf style room of one's own. You'll need to have your own little retreat center where you can journal, meditate and create when you need a cathartic outlet from the intense feelings that planets in the eighth house can churn up this year. Intimate, one-on-one -on -one relationships are also the eighth house's domain. And we're not talking one-and-done hangouts either, Gemini even though you've broken speed records for creating I feel like I've known you for my entire life connections. What's the difference between 15 minutes or 15 years when you click, right? This year, partnerships could become permanent and hella sexy, too. But nothing less than a mind-body-soul connection will do. You'd rather have no one than the wrong one in 2020? especially since you'll find so much richness in your own company. Financially, sharing assets and joining resources can help you stabilize, and flourish. With three eclipses in Cancer and Capricorn activating your money axis in the first half of 2020, you could drum up capital from surprising sources. An investor might offer to put dollars behind your dreams. Maybe you'll explore a business loan or crowdfund a campaign. If you need to repair your credit or get a handle on debt, these eclipses speed up progress. Gemini 2020 Horoscope, Love and Relationships Fueling your charm offensive in 2020 will be vivacious Venus. From April 3rd to August 7th, the celestial seductress takes an extended tour through Gemini, ratcheting up your sensuality and sex appeal. Creative downloads will be epic, so if you're working on a novel, a painting series, or an EP, don't overbook yourself during this four-month window. You never know when the muse might strike. What's the difference between 15 minutes or 15 years when you click, right? This year, partnerships could become permanent and hella sexy, too. But nothing less than a mind-body-soul connection will do. You'd rather have no one than the wrong one in 2020, especially since you'll find so much richness in your own company. Financially, sharing assets and joining resources can help you stabilize, and flourish. With three eclipses in Cancer and Capricorn activating your money axis in the first half of 2020, you could drum up capital from surprising sources. An investor might offer to put dollars behind your dreams. Maybe you'll explore a business loan or crowdfund a campaign. If you need to repair your credit or get a handle on debt, these eclipses speed up progress. Gemini 2020 Horoscope, Love and Relationships Fueling your charm offensive in 2020 will be vivacious Venus. From April 3rd to August 7th, the celestial seductress takes an extended tour through Gemini, ratcheting up your sensuality and sex appeal. Creative downloads will be epic, so if you're working on a novel, a painting series, or an EP, don't overbook yourself during this four-month window. You never know when the muse might strike. Normally, Venus hovers in a single sign for four weeks, but she's posted up in Gemini for so long because from May 13th to June 25th, the love planet will take her biennial retrograde. 
With the cosmic coquette reverse commuting through your sign for nearly six weeks, there could be crossed signals in the game of love. During the backspin, be careful not to rush into a commitment, make assumptions about your SO or invite a toxic ex back into your life. If you play your cards right, Venus retrograde can be a bountiful time, helping you find diplomatic ways to work through conflicts with the ones you adore. Ultimately, Venus wants peace, love and harmony but that doesn't mean making an emotional bypass over tough issues. On May 5, the lunar north node will shift into Gemini, its first visit to your sign since April 2003. This special point in the sky directs our collective destiny. The world will hum at a Gemini frequency until January 2022 a huge advantage for twins. Your stellar intellect and communication skills will give you the leading edge. And with your first house of identity lit, you could rebrand. Yourself with a fresh career path or a totally unprecedented style, or both. This is a time to develop your gifts and invest in personal growth. Another nudge towards independence comes from March 21st to July 1st, as Saturn darts into Aquarius and activates your ninth house of travel, expansion, and higher learning. You will begin breaking free from suffocating entanglements during this three and a half month window, but it might take until the end of 2020 before you truly liberate yourself. On December 17th, 2020, the ringed planet shifts into Aquarius until March 7th, 2023. Two days later, on December 19, jovial Jupiter will join Saturn in the water bearer's realm and on the winter solstice, December 21, they'll make an ultra-rare connection at 0 degree 29 Aquarius. This tete-a-tete, -tete, which astrologers have dubbed the Great Conjunction, only happens every 20 years. Power up for a major mission, Gemini. With Jupiter activating your enterprising spirit and Saturn providing the structure to bring big ideas to life, this day is like a launchpad for your dreams. With your global ninth house in the Great Conjunction's crosshairs, you might need a plane ticket or an international visa to get this one into orbit. Have vision, we'll travel. Cancer 2020 Horoscope, June 21st to July 22nd, Relationships Rule Ready for your best relationship year in over a decade? In 2020, your dynamic duos are on fire provided you play your cards right. What will it take to open your heart? Read on. No crab is an island of fact that will be proven true in your 2020 horoscope, Cancer, as planets sail through the most relationship-focused houses of your solar chart. As a highly sensitive water sign, you're not just susceptible to picking up vibes from other people, you absorb them like a, c, sponge. Pulling back into your shell can be a matter of self-preservation. As the year begins, growth agent Jupiter is co-piloting through Capricorn alongside stable Saturn and transformational Pluto. With this cosmic consortium in your seventh house of committed relationships, you'll shift into pairing mode. From project partners to long-term love matches, you're a highly attractive force. And with worldly Jupiter logged into this zone, your signals will travel, drawing intriguing prospects from a wide radius. While logical Saturn ensures that you won't stray too far from what's sensible, seductive Pluto and daring Jupiter save you from falling into ennui. It was Cancerian Selena Gomez who crooned, the heart wants what it wants. In 2020, you're more risk-tolerant when it comes to relationships, willing to take chances on partnerships that come with complex circumstances, like living in different cities, states, or countries. Bottom line, 2020 could be huge for relationships but you'll have to open your heart. Want to know how? Cancer 2020 Horoscope, Love and Relationships Another reason to peek out of your shell? Throughout the year, Saturn, Jupiter, and Pluto will mix and mingle, meeting up at exact degrees of Capricorn and Aquarius, where they'll combine their formidable strengths in your intimate relationship zones, the 7th and 8th houses. These cosmic combos are extremely rare, the Saturn-Pluto meetup, which occurs on January 12, 2020, only happens every 33 to 38 years. This year's three Jupiter-Pluto connections, on April 4th, June 30 and November 12, occur every 12 years, 
and the great conjunction of Jupiter and Saturn this December 21st takes 20 years to repeat. Just one of these planetary power couplings in a single year would be jaw-dropping. Having all three marks a unique moment in astrological history even if some uncomfortable stretching is required to maximize the benefits. Need to set better boundaries, Cancer? Or, for the more tender-hearted among you, learn what a boundary actually is? Loving Venus will spend an extended cycle in Gemini and your sacrificial 12th house from April 3rd to August 7th. Because of a retrograde from May 13th to June 25th, the congenial planet will linger here four times longer than usual. Melody Beattie's codependent No More could become a dog-eared, yellow highlighted Bible on your nightstand as you learn how to reign in some of your enabling ways. Do you struggle to stay centered when others are close? Learn about the four main attachment styles, Amir Levine and Rachel S. F. Heller's Attached is a must read, and find out if you've been an anxious attracting avoidance, or vice versa. Cancer 2020 Horoscope, Career and Money Relax, Cancer, you'll still enjoy some sacrosanct solo moments in 2020. Two of the year's six eclipses land in your sign, activating your first house of autonomy and individual expression. The inaugural full moon of the year, on January 10, is a Cancer lunar eclipse an auspicious way to launch the new decade. You'll enjoy rapid manifestation as this lunar lift corresponds to the galvanizing solar, new moon, eclipse of July 2, 2019. On June 21, the final Cancer eclipse in this two-year series pairs with a new moon. This solar eclipse is like a ribbon-cutting ceremony for your important dreams, maybe one that you've been developing since as far back as July 2018. But wait, there's more. In 2020, you get a bonus new moon in your sign. On July 20, a second new moon in Cancer will echo the themes of the June 21st eclipse, giving you another launchpad for your One Crab missions. The power of partnership extends to your career especially between March 21st and July 1st, when Saturn darts forward into Aquarius, lending gravitas to your 8th house of investments and joint ventures. The ringed taskmaster hasn't visited this part of your chart since January 1994, but his arrival will get you serious about creating long-term wealth. The 8th house is the sexiest sector of the zodiac wheel, sharing similar qualities to Scorpio, the 8th sign. Gaining command over your finances will make you feel like one powerful vixen. But Saturn is slow moving and deliberate so forget about turning into the wolf of Wall Street. This spring and summer may find you focused on paying off old debts and balancing your books. When Saturn springs back into Aquarius for a longer tour, from December 17, 2020, until March 7, 2023, you'll be ready to start playing the market and building your portfolio and you'll get a helping hand from fortuitous Jupiter, who joins Saturn in Aquarius from December 19, 2020, to December 29, 2021. Another boon for your career comes on June 27, when Maximizer Mars lumbers into Aries and your 10th house of success. Normally, the red planet visits here for seven weeks every other year. But due to a biennial retrograde from September 9 to November 13, Mars lends a potent charge to your ambitions that lingers through January 6, 2021. Build as much momentum as you can between June 27 and September 9, then handle backstage developments during the reversal. You could have something awe-inspiring to launch after November 13. Is leadership calling? Mars in aggrandizing Aries calls for boldness. If you've earned your stripes, Step forward as an expert or authority in your field before the year is through. Leo 2020 Horoscope, July 23rd to August 22nd, Put Yourself First Efficiency is the name of the game if you want to reach your lofty goals, Leo. Your 2020 horoscope encourages you to organize everything from your closet to calendar, scale back caretaking and get creative. What will it take to pull that off? Read on. No green juice toast to your health, Leo. And a round of blue spirulina tonics for all your friends. The new decade is off to a salubrious start for your 2020 horoscope, 
as vital Jupiter cannonballs into Capricorn and joins powerhouses Saturn and Pluto in your sixth house of wellness and work. These three planets haven't synced up like this since 1285 CE so this is major news. Some long overdue restructuring is order, as you hack away habits that drain your life force and replace them with processes that support your radiance. Whether you're in decent shape or dealing with some health challenges, this cosmic trio raises the bar. Are you tending to mind, body and spirit? In 2020, you could become a meditation maven, a plant-based practitioner or a guru of all things green, clean and serene. Bottom line, 2020 could be a major year for vibrant health and money, but you'll have to make a few life changes. Want to know how? Leo 2020 Horoscope, Career and Money Get honest, where are you leaking energy, Leo? With two final eclipses hitting Cancer and your boundary challenged 12th house on January 10th and June 21st, and one more in Capricorn and your systematic 6th on July 5th, you'll need to draw sharper lines with people in your world. If you don't, your magnanimous nature could infect you with resentment never a good look for a sunny Leo. Thankfully, a socially supportive star map is also ahead in 2020. From April 3rd to August 7th, Convivial Venus embarks on an extended tour through Gemini and your 11th house of community, technology, and activism. Get out and circulate, even if your INSTagram and Facebook friend lists runneth over. The Zodiac's jungle ruler can never have too many acquaintances, as long as they can match your generosity. While Venus is retrograde from May 13th to June 25th, and every other year event, you may have to banish a few energy vampires from your realm. Leo 2020 Horoscope, Love and Relationships With love goddess Venus logged into your tech-savvy 11th house, April through August could bring some lucky swipes on the dating apps. And maybe the return of the disappearing Tinder date during the May 13th to June 25th retrograde. Proceed with cautious optimism. Coupled lions should circulate more as a power couple, knitting together your friend groups and organizing dinner parties, weekend trips, and other fun for the people you both adore. But you may feel like getting, ahem, unhinged, starting June 27th, when lusty Mars moves into Aries for an extended tour through your worldly, independent ninth house that lasts until January 6, 2021. The red planet will also pivot retrograde in 2020, from September 9th to November 13th. During that time, even happily partnered Leos will have to navigate some fiery emotions. Pro tip, absence makes the heart grow fonder. Waiting for your partner to join you on an adventure could mean missing out on a life-changing opportunity. Don't limit your own expansion, Leo. Do your thing and you can share all the magic with your mate when you return to the lair. Relationships will take a turn for the serious. From March 21st to July 1st when enduring Saturn settles into Aquarius and your seventh house of committed coupling. Light-hearted love affairs could hit a will we or won't we turning point, and you won't be content to play the field. On December 17th, the ringed planet will park in Aquarius for a longer spell, until March 7, 2023 putting partnerships through some endurance tests. Thankfully, jovial Jupiter will keep the spirit of romance alive, joining Saturn in Aquarius from December 19, 2020, until December 29, 2021. A new series of eclipses begins this year on the Gemini-Sagittarius axis, which will illuminate the balance between being a team player and stepping forward as the star. You're an ace at both when you want to be but no need to pull the modesty card. The two Sagittarius eclipses, on June 5th and December 14th, stir things up in your fifth house of fame, passion, and romance. You're quite the head-turner on the average day, Leo, but your star qualities will be in rare form under these two lunar lifts. You could end the year with a powerful mistletoe moment, or with something fabulous to debut to your ever-growing fanbus. Virgo 2020 Horoscope August 23rd to September 22nd, embrace your inner showstopper. Your best year for love in over a decade is here. 
the pleasure principle is alive and fully operational for Virgos in 2020 as a planetary posse sachets down the step and repeat of your fifth house of fame, decadence, and heart-thumping romance. Ready for it, Virgo? Here's what it will require. Anyone who is still laboring under the delusion that your sign is quiet or boring, or, cough, virginal, is about to get schooled. Your flamboyant side will not be repressed, in fact, your Virgo 2020 horoscope predicts it will spill out like a glorious and colorful cascade. Embrace your role as a showstopper. As the new decade dawns, you'll burst onto the scene in a shower of glitter, sequins, and confetti to claim your crown. For the first time since the year 1285 CE, lucky Jupiter, stabilizing Saturn, and transformational Pluto are traveling in close alignment through Capricorn and your theatrical fifth house. Throughout the year, they'll mix and mingle, meeting up for rare conjunctions in the sky. On January 12, Saturn and Pluto sync up for the first time in 35 years. This could bring a game-changing moment that shifts the course of your romantic future or positions you as a spotlight-stealing luminary. Because these serious stars don't mess around, you could make your first momentous decision right after the new year. Bottom line, 2020 is the year for love, passion, and fame but you'll have to let go of that Virgo need to plan. Want to know how? Virgo 2020 Horoscope, Love and Relationships your romantic palette expands in colorful ways, as dazzling Jupiter and seductive Pluto dance cheek to cheek three times this year, on April 4, June 30th and November 12th. Presently unattached? Since Jupiter is the galactic globetrotter, it's anyone's guess on which coast or continent true love awaits you. No matter your GPS coordinates, the landscape of your love life will be punctuated by romantic highs. Attached? This is the year to tick that epic vacation off your shared bucket list. The only catch? Heavenly heartthrobs Venus and Mars both turn retrograde in 2020. These are less than optimal periods for planning anything romantic, from that trip to Fiji to your destination wedding. Blackout May 13th to June 25th while Venus is in reverse. This could bring a game-changing moment that shifts the course of your romantic future or positions you as a spotlight-stealing luminary. Because these serious stars don't mess around, you could make your first momentous decision right after the new year. Bottom line, 2020 is the year for love, passion, and fame but you'll have to let go of that Virgo need to plan. Want to know how? Virgo 2020 Horoscope, Love and Relationships your romantic palette expands in colorful ways, as dazzling Jupiter and seductive Pluto dance cheek to cheek three times this year, on April 4, June 30th and November 12. Presently unattached? Since Jupiter is the galactic globetrotter, it's anyone's guess on which coast or continent true love awaits you. No matter your GPS coordinates, the landscape of your love life will be punctuated by romantic highs. Attached? This is the year to tick that epic vacation off your shared bucket list. The only catch? Heavenly heartthrobs Venus and Mars both turn retrograde in 2020. These are less than optimal periods for planning anything romantic, from that trip to Fiji to your destination wedding. Blackout May 13th to June 25th while Venus is in reverse. And September 9th to November 13th while Mars is off course. Already booked the chapel or the romantic getaway. Forewarned is forearmed, so be prepared to navigate a few curveballs if you do anything ceremonial during those dates. If marriage is on the docket during Venus retrograde, plan on renewing your vows in 2021 at your one year anniversary. Since the cosmic lovebirds only go retrograde every other year, rest assured that the renewal ceremony will not suffer a fault in the stars. Virgo 2020 Horoscope career and money. Saturn leaves the Capricorn party for a short window, lunging forward into Aquarius and your sixth house of work and wellness from March 21st to July 1st. You'll have your nose to the grindstone and your feet in statement sneakers as you pound the pavement, hustling to achieve your grander ambitions. A fitness practice could get you in fighting shape, whether you do sun salutations or spin. 
Saturn is the taskmaster of the skies, and while he tours this industrious zone, you run the risk of burning the candle at both ends. Thankfully, a two-year Gemini slash Sagittarius eclipse series begins on June 5th, helping you create better work-life balance. Professionally, 2020 serves up both passion and productivity. While Celestial Charmer Venus takes an extended tour through Gemini and your career zone from April 3rd to August 7th, you'll be living proof that it's all about who you know. Strategic socializing helps you dart ahead of the competition and you'll be keen to collaborate with other creatives. This is a power couple cycle, so pairing up with another luminary, perhaps even the one who shares your bed, could bring a huge win. Just make sure you don't step on their toes when Venus backs into a challenging retrograde from May 13th to June 25th. With driven Mars also on extended tour through your 8th house of investments from June 27th, 2020, to January 6th, 2021, you could leap on a fortuitous opportunity, like buying real estate in an emerging neighborhood or funding a startup in exchange for stock that quickly rises in value. Be mindful during the Red Planet's retrograde from September 9th to November 13th, however, because this shadowy nine-week period could bring sketchy deals and fast-talking hucksters. The year wraps with a major astrological event called the Great Conjunctions, which falls on December 21st alongside the winter solstice. As Saturn and Jupiter station themselves in your sixth house of healthy routines, on December 17th and 19th respectively, they'll meet up at 0 degree 29 Aquarius, combining their paradoxical powers. Jupiter expands and Saturn contracts. Together they create the perfect system of checks and balances for one another. Just in time for the holidays, your legendary planning powers resume. As Saturn hands you the project manager's baton and exuberant Jupiter fuels your ideals, we can bet you'll be dreaming of a Christmas, or Kanaka or Kwanzaa, in your sign's favorite hue, lush and leafy green. Libra 2020 Horoscope, September 23rd to October 22nd, Home-Based Adventures Home is where the heat is in 2020 and lots of change. Start collecting silk pajama sets, marabou slippers, and cooling eye masks. Major growth awaits in 2020. Are you ready for it? Read on. Matters of home and the heart will be Libra's priority in 2020, as your planets weave in and out of your low-key fourth house and your luxurious fifth. This year, your lair will be the place to kick up your feet and maybe even swing from the chandeliers with a titillating guest of honor. For the past two years, since December 19, 2017, to be exact, rational Saturn and mystical Pluto have been co-piloting through Capricorn and your fourth house, lending their intense, karmic energy to home and family affairs. On January 12, 2020, they'll make an ultra-rare exact meetup, which happens every 33 to 38 years, which could start the year off on a powerful, emotional note. A matter involving real estate or a relative could come to resolution, as stabilizing Saturn helps to ground Pluto's transformational beams. Exhale, Libra, because you are bound to gain some major clarity about how to best support the people. You adore. Bottom line, 2020 could be an epic year for home and family but you'll have to take action faster than you normally would. Want to know how? Libra 2020 Horoscope career and money. Chateau Libra will be a buzzing hive of activity this year, too, since vibrant, venturesome Jupiter will also be in Capricorn until December 19. How can you set up your home so that it supports all your visionary dreams? Your kitchen table could become the birthplace of a thriving home-based business. Some Libras will start a family-owned company, and since Jupiter rules travel, you could work with people, even relatives overseas. Three eclipses on the Cancer-slash-Capricorn axis will accelerate any such events in January, June, and July. Your career will be number-blessed by this eclipse series, so get ready for some well-deserved rewards for the past two years of hard work, especially near the January 10th lunar, full moon, eclipse in Cancer. On June 5th, a new 18-month series of eclipses in Gemini and Sagittarius begins to rock your communication axis. You'll feel moved to get your message out to the masses.
or at least to your corner of the world. Is there a book, workshop, or documentary series bubbling around in your head? Maybe you've thought about becoming a coach or a teacher. Start exploring ways to share your vast knowledge with the world. Libra 2020 Horoscope, Love and Relationships A new wave of energy comes in on March 21, when Sirius Saturn ambles into Aquarius and your fifth house of fame, fertility, and true love until July 1. Some Libras could meet a long-term partner for songwriting or baby-making or finally commit to next steps. But don't stress if you get more mojo from the muse than you do from Cupid. This is an advanced preview of a longer circuit that begins on December 17, 2020, when Saturn flows into Aquarius until March 7, 2023. Even better? On December 19, No Limits Jupiter will also enter Aquarius, pushing you into the limelight or a lover's arms, or both. If you're already living the dream, professionally and romantically, you'll be ready to manifest a bold and exciting new phase. Mark your calendar for the winter solstice, December 21st is a power day. For the first time since the year 2000, Jupiter and Saturn will meet at the same degree, in Aquarius, sparking an event called the Great Conjunction. As these two heavy hitters exchange love notes, you could figure out how to map the elusive mix of excitement, Jupiter, and stability, Saturn. Yes, Libra, the two can coexist in a healthy, empowering way. Your ruling planet, coquettish Venus, puts you in fine flirting form and just in time for the spring. From April 3rd to August 7th, the galactic goddess of love and beauty zips through Gemini and your adventurous ninth house. Amor may arrive with a seductive accent, or you could finally book that vacation with your one and only. The catch? Venus will be retrograde from May 13th to June 25th, which could bring mixed messages and blasts from the past. You won't want to leap capriciously during this challenging six weeks but you might sign up for a few couples therapy sessions or block your distracting ex's number. Red Hot Mars will also be in your relationship corner this year, spurring you to get closer to a handful of key people, both in business and personal realms. From June 27 until January 6, 2020 The planet of lust, drive, and motivation takes an extended tour through Aries and your seventh house of partnerships. Yes. Sigh, this also includes a tempestuous retrograde phase from September 9 to November 13. You could lock horns with the people closest to you, but also unearth some of the long-standing issues that have been blocking you from true intimacy. Simultaneously, you may strike a dynamic duet with someone and shoot up the charts as a pair. Bottom line? This year will bring tons of exciting developments, especially with the people in your life. But with so much planetary action in Capricorn galvanizing the foundation of your chart, you need deep enough roots to keep yourself grounded. From a peaceful home base to a supportive family, whether chosen or blood-related, remember, Libra, you don't have to do this alone. Scorpio 2020 Horoscope, October 23rd to November 21st, Share Your Message You've got a major message to share in 2020 and the world eagerly awaits. What will it take to step up to the mic and into your power in 2020? Read on to find out. Your investigative sign loves a mystery, Scorpio, and there are no shortages of riddles to solve in 2020. But this year will be different in one fundamental way, Scorpio, to crack any case, lead with curiosity, not suspicion. Did your eternally raised eyebrow just shoot up another millimeter? We're not surprised. But trust us Scorpio, the journey can be as blissful as the destination. At times, this year will feel like a roller coaster ride, kind of like the line from the cult classic Pee Wee's Big Adventure, where your Scorpio sign mate Pee Wee Herman exclaims, it's like you're unraveling a big cable knit sweater that someone keeps knitting and knitting and knitting. Keep pulling at those loose threads and eventually the full story will reveal its pattern. Stay engaged even when you are frustrated. It's hard for your savvy sign to remember this, but here goes, you don't have to have it all figured out. 
surrender to the unknown and let 2020 take you on a magical mystery tour. Bottom line, 2020 is your year to spread a message but you'll have to emerge from the shadows. Want to know how? Scorpio 2020 Horoscope, Career and Money 2020 is certainly going to be more entertaining than last year. From November 2018 until early December 2019, expansive Jupiter was grinding away in Sagittarius and your second house of work and daily routines. The perks may have included a new job and better pay. But the responsibilities of your new revenue streams also left your nose fixed to the grindstone there was no free lunch in 2019. If your social life withered on the vine as a result, it's no surprise. On December 2, 2019, jovial Jupiter merged lanes into Capricorn, joining Stoic Saturn and your ruler, magnetic Pluto, in your convivial, mercurial third house. In 2020, these three planets are involved in a sweet choreography, gliding in close, and at some points, exact, contact with each other all year. But since their energies are so different, figuring out which planet is leading could feel like an eternal dance-off inside your head. Should you be effusively friendly, Jupiter, or play it cool, Saturn? Or maybe be alluringly esoteric and make them come to you, Pluto? Instead of fixating on this, make fun your focus in 2020. For your serious sign, this might can be downright revolutionary. Could it be that, simple? Yes, Scorpio, it can. And if you open yourself up to experimentation instead of trying to find the thing, this could be the most buzzworthy year you've had in over a decade. As one of the zodiac's four fixed signs, along with Taurus, Leo, and Aquarius, you pride yourself on being the expert and authority in your field. As such, you tend to focus intently on one thing at a time. Switch up your strategy this year because 2020 is all about being a dabbling dilettante instead. As you life hack your way into this new decade, you'll gain the breadth of knowledge to match your inherent depth. A formidable combination. As you log a library of new references and experiences into your powerful memory bank, you'll be a walking, talking oracle. Stretching your mental wingspan won't require you to travel far, since the third house rules local activity. But no matter what, your mind and your mouth will be in motion. Short-term education falls under the domain of the third house. Be the queen of the workshop scene or the emperor of online courses. The requisite training could be a LYFT ride or a login away. Scorpio 2020 Horoscope, Love and Relationships Any sort of intellectual stimulation will be a major turn on this year, and single Scorpios will bore quickly of people who can't match your brains and wit. A sapiosexual connection, however, will be a huge aphrodisiac. And while you'll be an unrepentant flirt, don't forget that you are a Scorpio, and you have a baseline need for stability and security. With love planet Venus fluttering through Gemini from April 3rd to August 7th, you'll be in your erotic element this spring and summer. Single Scorpios could magnetize a mate who is both delectable and devoted. Surprise! An old flame could be rekindled while Venus is retrograde from May 13th to June 25th. But if you sense this might turn into a dumpster fire, keep that door firmly closed. Thankfully, there will be some grounding action going on at the bottom of your chart this year. In Aquarius and your fourth house of roots. From March 21st to July 1st, stabilizing Saturn hunkers down in the water bearer's domain. You may feel some early rumblings of domesticity this spring and summer, but don't rush into apartment hunting yet. Wait until Saturn returns to this realm for a longer trek from December 17th, 2020. To March 7, 2023. Toward the end of the year, lucky, expansive Jupiter joins the nesting expedition, flowing through Aquarius from December 19, 2020, to December 29, 2021. Near the holidays, you could make an important decision about your living arrangements or a meaningful family matter. The second half of 2020 could bring exciting financial developments. Beginning June 5, 
a series of Gemini slash Sagittarius eclipses will power up your money axis for 18 months. Eclipses bring hidden possibilities to light, and there are three that touch down here this year, on June 5th, November 30th, and December 14th. These initiatives won't just stay on the great ideas I'll work on someday spreadsheet. From June 27th, 2020, until January 6th, 2021. Motivator Mars takes an extended voyage through Aries and your industrious sixth house. The second half of the year is all about turning your ideas into tangible form. This Mars cycle will bring lots of momentum for a wellness quest. But you'll have to fight your tendency to obsessively burrow into work. Put in measures so you don't skip meals or let exercise slip until you get the job done. Make healthy eating and movement a non-negotiable part of your daily routines. Lean into Saturn's flair for structure and schedule your work around your well-being instead of the other way. A radical notion, but one that will keep fuel in your tank. Sagittarius 2020 Horoscope, November 22nd to December 21st, your big money year is here. Ready to active abundance and a solid source of income? Your Sagittarius 2020 horoscope gives you a clearly defined flight path after a year of extreme exploration. This could be your wealthiest year in over a decade. But, there's a catch. Good news in 2020, your focus will be as sharp as a ninja's throwing star. For this you have your galactic guardian, Jupiter, to thank along with power brokers Pluto and Saturn, who are co-piloting the mission. Your red-spotted ruler will spend all of 2020 in Capricorn and your rooted second house. The last time these three heavy hitters aligned was 1,284-5 CE, so yes, this is kind of a big deal. Draft your blueprint for success and you'll keep the coffers filled for years to come. As a Sagittarius, you have two favorite speeds, fast and faster. Cautious Capricorn, on the other hand, cruises along like a luxury car, totally capable of racing ahead, but only hitting peak acceleration when it's time for a victory lap. With the Jupiter-Saturn-Pluto trio assembled in earthy, material-minded Capricorn, you may feel a bit out of your element even when you are knocking the ball out of the park winning 2020 will require the fine art of patience, which is not inherently a Sagittarius specialty. You'll have to remind yourself, over and over that being a tortoise instead of a hare is the fastest way to the finish line. Just try not to bite your nails down to the quick while you wait for results to roll in. Bottom line, 2020 could be your most prosperous year in over a decade but you'll have to prioritize. Want to know how? Sagittarius 2020 Horoscope, Career and Money For many archers, 2019 brought its share of stops and starts, so you're already used to this one foot on the gas, the other on the brake routine. Saturn has been trudging through Capricorn since December 19, 2017, forcing you to work at a measured pace. Despite that, you spent a good part of 2019 barreling down the astrological autobahn, as daredevil Jupiter raced through Sagittarius from November 8, 2018 through December 2, 2019. That once-per-decade voyage was heaven for your indie spirit. Along with an overwhelming desire for freedom, you were hell-bent on breaking past a stultifying plateau. And we're betting you did just that. As you greet 2020, you could have a great reason to raise a bonus champagne toast. Maybe you landed a plum new job or raised a round of venture capital. Did you get married, and a bad romance or discover a shared purpose with your SO? Relocate to a joy-inducing zip code that feels so Sagittarius. Maybe you overcame a limiting belief that was holding you back financially or emotionally. Pop that cork and send up some gratitude to the universe. While you probably won't have a ton of dramatic updates to report in 2020, you are poised for a payoff, resulting from the strategic risks you took in 2019. The only catch? Remembering that the discovery phase has drawn to a close. As the new decade dawns, head to the drafting table and start running your visionary schemes through the project management filter. You're very much at the ground floor in 2020, 
which means your focus should be on building a rock-solid foundation for your future empire. Visuals and branding are always part of the game. But not at the expense of other back-end developments. Your life may look more like a construction site than a dream home this year. But before you bring in the metaphoric cranes and wrecking balls, work like a master architect. Get crystal clear about what you want your final product to be. Holding that vision will get you through those slow as molasses moments that test your Sagittarius, I'm, patience. Then, run the numbers. What time, energy, and resources will be needed to pull this off? With lucky Jupiter in your financial zone until December 19th, you'll be fired up about fundraising, should you discover that pulling off your dream will be more expensive than anticipated. And while Saturn will spend a good part of 2020 in Capricorn, from January 1st until March 21st, then again from May 10th to July 1st, the cosmic taskmaster also darts forward into Aquarius and your cooperative, communicative third house for a short spring stint. Then, on December 17th, 2020, Saturn will officially call Aquarius its home until March 7, 2023. This is the ringed planet's first dip into the water bearer's well since January 1994. During this three-year cycle, you'll learn to separate the wheat from the chaff in your personal life. Relationships with siblings, neighbors, co-workers, and other peers go through a renovation process. You may team up on a serious project that necessitates a formal contract. As the saying goes, people are in your life for a season, a reason, or a lifetime. With enduring Saturn writing the rules of engagement, people will have to earn their loyalty points if they want to share your generous bounty. The December 21st winter solstice could bring a watershed moment. That day, Saturn will make a rare, as in once every 20 years, exact meetup with Jupiter. They'll unite at 0 degree 29 Aquarius an event called the Great Conjunction. As 2020 draws to a close, you'll see clearly who should play a starring role in this emerging new chapter of your life. Surprise! Some people may be quiet supporters who are more traditional or conservative than the folks you tend to gravitate toward. As Saturn lumbers through Aquarius until March 7, 2023, test collaborative ventures on a project-by-project -project basis. Know this, with such a process-driven planet at the wheel. It might take a few missions to get your work styles aligned and your respective roles defined. Don't hit the snooze button on 2020 yet, Sagittarius. There will be some free zones of excitement to keep your blood pumping. On June 5, a fresh, 18-month-long eclipse series erupts across the Sagittarius-Gemini axis with two more following on November 30th and December 14th. These momentous moonbeams light a fire under stalled passion projects while expediting relationship developments. The last time eclipses landed on this lunar axis was between December 21st, 2010, and May 25th, 2013. Flip back in your calendar to see what was happening then if you can recall. Similar themes may recur between June 5th, 2020, and December 3, 2021. Along with the eclipses, the lunar nodes, aka the cosmic destiny points will also shift from the Cancer-Capricorn line to the Gemini-Sagittarius axis on May 5, 2020. The last time the nodes were in this position was between October 14, 2001, and April 14, 2003. With the South Node in Sagittarius and your first house of self-expression until January 18, 2022. Your karmic gifts will be called to the fore. In many ways, you'll feel guided by a mystical force come May which might feel like a heavier responsibility at times. And yet, Archer, there's no avoiding your soul work. Heed the call. Sagittarius 2020 Horoscope, Love and Relationships Simultaneously, the Moon's fateful North Node will dwell in Gemini and your seventh house of partnerships from May 5, 2020 until January 18, 2022. A soulmate, or soul friend, relationship could emerge, adding a powerful dimension into your life. Love planet Venus also takes an extended tour through Gemini and your seventh house of partnerships from April 3 through August 7. 
Due to a retrograde from May 13 to June 25, Venus will hover in this sign four times longer than she does on the average year. While this may drive up some buried issues within your closest relationships, the planetary peacemaker and diplomat is here to support you. Don't just smooth over rough edges. Use the retrograde to get to the root of any recurring breakdowns. Then reconstruct your most important bonds according to a new, shared vision. Mars will also turn retrograde from September 9 to November 13 a cycle that happens every other year. In 2020, the backspin takes place in Aries, which is the red planet's home sign. As a result, Mars will linger in the Ram's realm for six months, from June 27, 2020, until January 6, 2021. Since Aries governs your fifth house of fame, romance, and creative expression, this extended transit lends a large dose of sizzle and glamour in the second half of the year. Along with that may be intense anxiety, since Mars and Aries can ratchet up stress levels. Life is not a performance, Sagittarius, it's an interactive and immersive experience. Bring your most authentic self to the show and watch your loyal fanbus grow. Capricorn 2020 Horoscope, December 22 to January 19, your luckiest year is here. New decade, new you. If anyone has dibs on that mantra, it's you, Capricorn. 2020 is your luckiest year in over a decade provided you are willing to embrace the unfamiliar. Here's how. In 2020, worldly Jupiter will soar through your sign, its first visit since January 5th. 2009. You may already be shining like a breakout star this New Year's Day, since the red spotted planet made landfall in your sign on December 2, 2019. Keep the momentum going. Jupiter will continue to bless you with its abundant beams until December 19, ensuring your Capricorn 2020 horoscope reveals a banner year for growth and expansion. And that's hardly the full story. For the majority of the 2020, Jupiter travels astride power broker Pluto and your ruler, masterful Saturn, as all three planets form a rare series of convergences in Capricorn. So rare, in fact, that this cosmic cluster hasn't occurred since 1285 CE. Thanks to this sea goat Samba in the sky, many born under your sign will make history as the new decade dawns. Good thing you are motivated by a challenge. Instead of getting swept up in a competition with the titans of industry, make it your goal to bring forth your best self perhaps in a public way. Not sure where to begin? Review all of the vision boards and journal entries from 2019, while Jupiter was meditating in your Wu 12th house. Last year, life may have felt stalled in suspended animation. Your intuition guided you, and now, all that randomness could start to make sense. Once you zero in on the right cue or clue, the next steps will become immediately obvious. Trust your instincts. You really learned how to do that in 2019 and it's a skill to bring into this new year. Bottom line, 2020 could be your luckiest year in over a decade, but you'll have to allow change to happen. Want to know how? Capricorn 2020 Horoscope, Career and Money Subterranean Pluto has been helping you plumb those depths since it moved into your sign in 2008. It remains there for four more years. And ever since December 19, 2017, your ruler, Strategic Saturn, has been touring Capricorn. Fortifying that solid foundation you need to stand on if you are to operate effectively in the world. As helpful as this planetary pairing has been, it's aroused its share of angst. Pluto has been poking at the darker corners of your psyche over the past 12 years, forcing you to explore, and hopefully make peace with, your own shadow. Have you discovered some deep-rooted fears or insecurities or maybe a need to change your life in a fundamental way? Alchemical Pluto's mission is to help you turn that lead you've mined into gold. Continue to explore and embrace your own emotions perhaps with the help of therapists, healers, and coaches. With Pluto traversing 22 degree 29 through 25 degree degrees Capricorn, goats born between January 10 to 18 will be plunged into the deepest inner work this year. Nevertheless, 
Pluto will put all Capricorns through paces in 2020. This may involve releasing a few more material world attachments. Since 2008, changes surrounding money, marriage, career, status, and family relationships, all things you hold dear, have felt like tectonic plates shifting beneath your feet. At the same time, you're undergoing an undeniable spiritual transformation. Fading away is the Capricorn people pleaser who feels pressured to be the rock for everyone in your midst or to play every game according to society's rules. And as you release the need for outside validation, you're becoming a seriously self-authorized sea goat. Your unflappable power will continue to emerge in a maze in the year ahead. On January 12th, CEO Saturn and transformational Pluto will mash up at the same degree of Capricorn which could see you stepping out and stepping up perhaps as the face of a new, green, movement. Jupiter and Pluto will dance cheek to cheek on April 4, June 30th and again on November 12. These planetary Paso Dobles probably won't win any mirror ball trophies. In fact, they could be painfully awkward and here's why, Authenticity Cop Jupiter is all about exposing the truth while secretive Pluto wants to guard every scrap of intel with its life. While you want to keep it real, you may feel unsure about where the TMI line is drawn. How much to share and how much to keep on the down low. Warning, you might not have total control over what's revealed near these three conjunctions. Make sure you can stand behind all of your choices, past and present. Are there skeletons rattling in your closet? If you're breathing, the answer is probably yes. If you're worried yours may come back to haunt you, get ahead of the curve by exposing the story yourself. Better people should hear it straight from your lips than some nefarious source who's not on Team Cappy. One day to highlight in neon pink is July 5th, when the full moon in Capricorn arrives as a lunar eclipse the last one in a series that began striking your sign on January 5th, 2019. Eclipses reveal hidden opportunities, the kind that may be so far off of your radar that it takes some provocative, even shocking, developments to get your attention. The good news is that whatever jaw-dropping events occur in early July may bring much desired closure or a milestone moment that you've been waiting to celebrate for more than a year. In 2019, a rare trio of eclipses landed in your sign, which already set these plans in motion. Look back to events that initiated near the solar, new moon, eclipses on January 5 and December 26, 2019. You may launch the next leg of this mission around July 5, 2020. Did something come to fruition within a month of the July 16, 2019, lunar, full moon, eclipse? History may repeat itself, but with an upgraded twist. Or, a missed opportunity from last July could present itself again. This time, be ready to carpe diem. Capricorn 2020 Horoscope love and relationships. Radical Uranus is officially buzzing through Taurus for its first full year, activating your fifth house of romance, glamour, and fierce self-expression. Can love and freedom go hand in hand? That's a worthy exploration. During this eight-year Uranus cycle, which lasts until 2026, you won't take kindly to anyone trying to tamp down your individuality. Some Capricorns may embrace their single status wholeheartedly, while others will want to balance sacred solo space against time spent with a significant other. With two Cancer eclipses firing up your relationship house on January 10 and June 21, a partner may demand clarification and exclusivity. Those eclipses can also jailbreak Capricorns from any confining relationship agreements that have you feeling more suffocated than sexy. Adding to this, love planets Venus and Mars will turn retrograde in 2020. While these reverse commutes can feel like setbacks at first, they are also blessed timeouts that allow you to review the way you do relationships. First to snooze will be peacekeeping Venus, who retreats through communicative Gemini and your sixth house of structures from May 13 to June 25. Time to negotiate new terms with your partner? You're a creature of habit, Capricorn, but a romance may hit the rocks if you're simply going through the motions. Drop the assumptions and get into dialogue about what each of you wants. Yes, 
you need your daily RDA of work time, exercise, relaxation, and so on, but you may want to shift your schedule to accommodate the one you love. Mars shifts into reverse from September 9th until November 13th in Aries and your fourth house of security, family, home, and roots. Tension under your roof could mount, especially if you don't have enough privacy and space for yourself. A love interest could pressure you to move in together. Or if you already cohabitate, you may decide to rent a studio slash workspace outside of the house so you can have what Virginia Woolf dubbed, a room of one's own. A little absence can definitely make the heart grow fonder as long as you don't go AWOL on your peeps. Capricorn season begins on December 21st along with one of the year's major cosmic events, called the Great Conjunction. This historical happening occurs approximately every 19 years, when Saturn and Jupiter make an exact alignment and combine their powers. In many ways, these two planets are total opposites. Saturn is the ringed taskmaster who moves slowly, and steadily, toward crushing every skill. Jupiter is idealistic, whimsical, and broad-minded. Saturn streamlines, Jupiter expands. Together, they can deliver the perfect hybrid of traditional wisdom and daring exploration. In 2020, their meetup takes place at 0 degree 29 Aquarius, activating your solar second house of work and money. What pot of gold will this rainbow connection lead you to, Capricorn? You may find it abroad or in your own backyard, but either way, you are likely to end the year with a giant leap towards prosperity. Aquarius 2020 Horoscope January 20 to February 18, Reality Shifts Ready for a transformational year? For Aquarius, 2020 is a giant clean-up mission, as you inspect and reinvent every cluttered corner of your life. Want to clear out the old and make space for the shiny and new? Read on. Your Aquarius 2020 horoscope delivers a transitional message as you straddle two worlds this year the old one that you are leaving behind and the new multiverse that's slowly forming in front of your eyes. Since December 2, 2019, Accelerator Jupiter has joined Taskmaster Saturn and Evolutionary Pluto in Capricorn and your 12th house of healing and transitions. Throughout the year, this heavy-hitting trio will mix and mingle with each other, triggering soulful awakenings and forcing you to surrender to the flow of the universe's agenda even when you were certain you had a better plan in mind. Bottom line, 2020 could be a transformational year, but you'll have to get comfortable with a range of emotions. Want to know how? Aquarius 2020 Horoscope, Career and Money Periodic plunges into the esoteric realm are unfamiliar. As an Aquarius, reality has always been a shifting concept. Plus, Saturn and Pluto have both been on a longer roll through Capricorn. The Ring Taskmaster has been trudging along this path since December 19, 2017. Alchemical Pluto has been rowing through the Sea Goat's waters since November 27, 2008, a 16-year voyage that continues until 2024. On January 12, 2020, Saturn and Pluto will host an ultra-rare meetup at 22 degree Capricorn a conjunction that only happens every 35 years. Together, they set your agenda for 2020, let go so you can grow. Now that change agent Jupiter has joined the party, there's no more time for chin scratching and intellectualizing. Jupiter wants traction, and he wants it now. If your inner child has been on a meandering exploration or learning at their own pace Jupiter will pull them out of the metaphoric Waldorf school to do some speed learning with a superstar tutor. We're not trying to traumatize you here, Aquarius. It's just that we know you're ready to make all those shifts that you've been talking about in your moon circles, therapy sessions, and online master classes. That means picking up the pace and packing up the old stuff. Yes, it will be emotional. There will be losses to grieve, bittersweet farewells, WTF am I doing, moments especially while Jupiter and Pluto team up on April 4th. June 30th and November 12th. But on the other side of this turbulence lies a beautiful blank canvas that's begging to be painted upon with this next chapter of your life. You're going to have to be patient with this process though. Slow-moving Saturn makes its presence known in your sign, 
darting in for a quick visit from March 21st to July 1st, then taking up a longer, three-year residence in Aquarius on December 17th. This is Saturn's first return to Aquarius since January 28, 1994. Before astronomers had strong enough telescopes to discover your modern-day ruler, side-spinning Uranus, it was Stoic Saturn who was tapped as your galactic guardian. This may explain your otherworldly ability to be totally eccentric one minute and a kick-ass project manager the next. Hosting Saturn in your sign can feel like cosmic boot camp. But grit your teeth and do the drills, water bearer. You'll emerge stronger, savvier, and more successful than you've been in years. Thankfully, you'll get solid support from jovial Jupiter. On December 19, the red-spotted planet will join Saturn in Aquarius, helping you joyfully embrace the learning curve. Highlight December 21st in orange highlighter. The winter solstice is also the date of the Great Conjunction, as Jupiter and Saturn meet up at 0 degree 29 Aquarius and combine their powerful energies. This event only happens every 20 years and the last one occurred on May 31st, 2000. Where to expand and where to contract. Major insight will come by the year's end. Aquarius 2020 Horoscope, Love and Relationships Yes, Aquarius, this might all sound rather formidable. But take heart. There will be plenty of uplifting transits happening in 2020. On May 5th, the lunar north node heads into Gemini in your festive, flirtatious, and fertile, fifth house. This 18-month destiny driver will be a creative renaissance for many of you. The stage will call Aquarius performers. Bring down the house at an open mic night or go slay an audition. Romantically, the North Node's tour of Gemini, which lasts until January 18, 2022, could bring epic developments. You might meet the love of your life, get engaged or have a baby or achieve some other self-styled milestone in the game of love. You write those rules, Aquarius. A new eclipse series on the Gemini slash Sagittarius axis will also galvanize your relationships, beginning with the full moon on June 5th. Also, Amorous Venus spends an extra long time in Gemini in your fifth house, from April 3rd to August 7th. Energetic Mars blazes through Aries and your social third house for nearly half the year from June 27th until January 6th, 2021, to be exact. Although both Venus and Mars will have retrograde phases in 2020, your social calendar will be booked with stimulating rendezvous, both with new people and folks from your past. Pisces 2020 Horoscope, February 19th to March 20th Review Your Crew New You, New Crew There's power in numbers in 2020, and collaborating could take your brilliant ideas to amazing heights. But are you ready for what this mission requires, Pisces? Read on. Come on up for air, Pisces. And while you're at it, take some cleansing breaths. Your Pisces 2020 horoscope gives you planetary permission to exhale. And maybe slip off for a meditation retreat around the March 21st equinox, too. Last year, No Limits Jupiter climbed to the top of your chart working its magic in your 10th house of success. Some fish spent 2019 with gills to the grindstone, developing your magnum opus or creating a venture that aligned with your ideals. You may have traveled for work, hustled remotely, and independently, or, like many Pisces we know, finally screwed up the courage to leave a corporate gig to pursue your passions. No matter what rung of the ladder you're on in 2020, your 2020 Pisces horoscope reveals you will not be lonely at the top. Nor at the ground floor, the cow or king cubicle, in coach or business class. That's because, since December 2, 2019, Jupiter has been soaring through Capricorn in your ultra-social, egalitarian 11th house. Until December 19, 2020 the red-spotted rabble-rouser will accompany transformational Pluto and Sirius Saturn through this sector, lifting the heavier vibes these weighty planets have cast over your social life since December 2017. This triumphant trio hasn't teamed up in Capricorn since 1285 CE, so yes, Pisces, 
2020 is going to bring some big deal revelations about the kinds of people you want to surround yourself with. The 11th house is the humanitarian zone, and this planetary push could ignite your activism, just in time for a climactic U.S. presidential election or other tide-turning global events. Bottom line, 2020 can bring exciting collaborations and trailblazing ideas, but you'll have to keep one fin on solid ground. Want to know how? Pisces 2020 Horoscope, Career and Money Get out and mingle like it was your job this year, because it might just be, especially near January 12th when power brokers Saturn and Pluto make an exact conjunction in Capricorn for the first time since the 1500s. There's a popular equation created by business guru Jim. Rome, to find your current earning potential, average the net worth of the five people closest to you. While we're not suggesting you judge people based on their balance sheets, this can be an eye-opening exercise. You can run the same numbers when it comes to love, are the five people closest to you in flourishing relationships or constantly pinging between highs and heartbreaks? You're influenced by the company you keep. Surround yourself with people who are thriving and watch your own social capital rise. When it comes to money-making missions and creative projects, this is the year to tap the hive mind and assemble a power posse. Start casting for new collaborators as soon as January 10th when the first of two buoyant eclipses helps you magnetize your soul squad. On June 5, a new series of eclipses will ripple across your home and career axis, touching down in Gemini, your domestic fourth house, and Sagittarius, your ambitious tenth. Consider this another push from the stars to nail the work-life balance thing, which may require you to delegate and collaborate. Teamwork makes the dream work in 2020. Speaking of dreams, yours could be wilder and more intuitive than ever from March 21st to July 1st as Saturn advances into Aquarius and your oracular 12th house for the first time since 1994. During this brief spell, powerful mentors may arrive to Sherpa you along a spiritual journey. Some old hurt and baggage might rise up to be healed, but the good news is that Saturn helps you dress those wounds in something much more effective than a band-aid, allowing you to fully recover. Yes, you'll have your karmic work cut out for you, but this is something your deep diving sign happens to relish. Plunge in. This short Saturn cycle is a preview of what's to come in the last two weeks of 2020. On December 17, the ringed guru parks in Aquarius again until March 7, 2023. Two days later, optimistic Jupiter joins him there, embarking on a year-long cycle through Aquarius. Then. Fanfare, December 21, 2020, marks a monumental mashup of Jupiter and Saturn at 0 degree 29 Aquarius an event astrologers call the Great Conjunction which only occurs every 20 years. Free fall down the rabbit hole, Pisces. It's the perfect day for a vision quest. A creative jam session or whatever can bring epiphanies. Expect violet light insights and inspired downloads unlike any you've had for years. You may also realize that it's time to set limits with people and situations that are draining your energy reserves. Pisces 2020 Horoscope, Love and Relationships Romance could take a back burner to the one love vibes of your friendship groups this year. But that doesn't mean Cupid's gone AWOL. Coupled fish should find a school where you both feel comfortable swimming which could literally involve signing up for a workshop series together or something more active, like crewing a sailboat or joining a summer lawn bowling league. Single Pisces could make that fortuitous right swipe on a dating app. You might even reconnect to an old flame when Jupiter meets up with seductive Pluto during a dual retrograde on June 30. Speaking of which, both of the love planets Venus and Mars have a retrograde spell in 2020. First up is Venus who will reverse commute through Gemini and your sensitive, domestic fourth house from May 13th to June 25th. During this time, please subscribe to the channel and press the bell to receive all new videos upon its release.